let's go so now we have a car parked up on the right i'm gonna have to give it some jewels she's seeing that part um that car over there on the left as well yeah so she's, she's not waiting. going to she's trying to to do something here this car's um, coming back yeah i'm gonna have to disengage oh. so that you're gonna have to do that back over again Welcome back to Spicy Tech. I am Mark. I'm Cry. And we have now the latest update 11.4.7.3. And we're running it on assertive mode. And we're just going to test it out to see. It's not really any difference in terms of from 11.2 to 0.3. But we're going to test it out in the parking lot of a Costco and on see a how it's. On a Sunday. <laughs> on a <laughs> Sunday <laughs> afternoon to see how it actually performs. We're also going to go to the park. So we're going to have some zigzags. We're going to get our first impression. So hold on tight and uh, let's see how uh, Marsha handles this. So I don't know why she's indicating right though. She has to indicate left to get out of it. But if I give it some jewels, still nothing. The car is parked in front of us. We have room on the left side. And uh, she's trying to get that, trying to go, go around the, the car, but that's not working out. Maybe we could try starting from over there. This is a, oh wait, they might, they might move soon. All right, so let's try this for the third, third time. time. All right, let's go. Let's try again and see. She's okay, indicating right that from now. Right indicator is not good. It's kind of strange. Yeah, and maybe turn down the speed a lot. Yeah, I'll turn it down. To oh, 20 that guy's sticking this out. This guy's poking out here. Oh, and she put down the mirrors. The mirror. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that's gonna help. Not really. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Whoa. Yeah, okay. Why is she swaying out there, ma'am? Yeah, a little bit. Uh, I watch behind too. People just appear out of nowhere. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So that was rough. <laughs> So we have some pedestrians now with their carts. Yeah, let me turn down that speed even more, like 10 or something. All right, let's go. So we have someone crossing here. Realizes that. Seeing as two persons. <laughs> yep. Okay, she thanks us. Don't thank me, thank the system. Thank Marsha. Thank Marsha. Okay, so now we have a okay, car, we have a pedestrians. Close to these people, okay. On the left there, we have some coming here too as well. So this is helping with the training the VRUs and predicting their trajectory, right? Yeah, there's a little the car coming up to the left here. And there's some people on the right. I'm giving it some slight jewels in order for her to move careful. forward. Because like right now she's extremely hesitant. You can see there's yeah. like a, a, a bajillion people. <laughs> but people just crossing the roads and she's just like taking a sweet a time sweet. now. Sweet time. We have pedestrians coming here on the right side and she tries to avoid that. I'm giving it some slight, just a, a touch on the pedal. Okay. She avoids them and continues on. Really, really, really hesitant, even on assertive mode. Um, just creeping, creeping at three kilometers. And we have a pedestrian here coming with a cart. She needs to avoid that, but then there's a truck oh. on the left. Okay, so she avoids oh, the... Okay. <laughs> So scared for those people for okay. a second. So there. now we have we're a little bit encroaching on the left uh, or the oncoming lane. And we have a right chain coming up here. So we're coming out of the parking lot. Can creep up. Uh, whoops, whoops, whoops. She needs to stop. I would stop, right? Okay. Is that person Person turning? making a left turn, okay. so that's fine. Oh, <laughs> we made it out alive. Oh, wow. <laughs> now we have to make a left turn here. And this left turn... I think it's it's decent, but we have uh, we have cars right next to us too as well, so we need to be, be careful. Able to see. Yeah. Oh, okay. A little bit hard on the brakes there. A little bit dangerous, yeah. And then these people are just swinging around this corner. Yeah, she needs to creep up because we have people like like these folks that just cut across to make their turns. And yeah, it's not really safe. Okay. Okay, so at least they see us, and we have time to go here now quickly, and she does that. A Probably more. perhaps Quickly, a little bit too better. passive. Yeah. Oh, I think it's us. I yeah. think that was the user error. Because well, actually, no, the speed... top speed was at 15. Yeah, that was that, us. At that turn. No, no, no. The top, the max speed was, uh, oh. was 15, and then it changed to 40. Oh, I once it was in the it. lane, which shouldn't really be the case. Yeah. yeah. We did set it to 15, but then the max was actually um, was actually oh, stuck see. at 15 for a couple of seconds, and then it changed. Okay. That's a tricky one, to be honest. Wow. I so, mean, what is the car supposed to do, right? And then these guys are trying to chain, trying to move there. She wants to turn right, though. 
Are we okay. going to Dunsville? We could do a location break. Yeah. Okay, okay so we're back online here, and uh, we have a whole bunch of GPS oh, uh, concerns. Oh, nice. That was really good, actually. That was really good because they had a truck here coming we at, some even... space, at some speed. We here. were so confused. <laughs> yeah. And this guy is just, like, right behind my ass. I don't know what's up with this guy. <laughs> He's just, just really has to be up there. <laughs> um, especially why especially when you're making a, a dangerous left turn this is how accidents happen right and you have people exactly. honking on it telling you hey go 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 but then there's oncoming cars <laughs> or so people. do you want to go into an oncoming car i'm not too sure yeah. but uh but yes i mean we uh a lot of the footage they we, we just missed but i apologize for that um we were, we were talking about the the whole uh, we're just ranting about the navigation where it doesn't allow us to select just city streets so that way we can mm -hmm. train the system on city streets and, and they can get that in mass um, if, if there's that feature and of course Google Maps gives you that ability too as well right right yeah and like it's just sometimes you want to save that battery so you want to just be on city streets or sometimes you just don't want to deal with the highway or even for like newer drivers or people who are just uncomfortable with going on the highway they need an option for you know if they want to just go on the city streets because eventually everyone is going to switch to electric at some point it's probably going to be government mandated so it's like why are we not making options for everyone for it to be accessible yeah well, that's, that's a fair point i mean i would argue that just using city streets alone it saves a couple of percentages i mean if i really want to have an efficient drive i mm -hmm. would prefer an opt-in for the city driving and just have a toggle so that i can switch between city streets and highway um, but then also with the navigation tool as well, when you select your navigational route to get to your destination, it tends to change midway when you're driving, which kind of throws, throws you off. And it, it happened to us today. And that's why, you know, we're here, you know, we, there's a huge gap in, in the, in the footage. <laughs> oh boy. It's a little bit frustrating, but I understand it can help in terms of having a, a dynamic route because if there's closures or traffic and so on, you want to change it up so you get to the to the destination in the fastest time possible. But you know, in terms of these videos, when you have when you have to pre-plot your your destination and your route, it kind of throws it off. So like all these mm -hmm. options should be available um, for the user yeah. to select from. And remember before, I don't know if it still happens when you like press the the pedal to continue, it would just try to kill you after. <laughs> Like it would just swing into oncoming traffic and like start like acting crazy. Remember that? Like no, I think they they really fixed that one. That was really bad because like you shouldn't be continuing to your destination and the, to the next stop and then it's like trying to swing into like oncoming traffic. Yeah, I think that there's definite improvements there. So we, I mean, we are seeing some incremental improvement improvements, um, and I'm bit, hoping bit, bit. in <laughs> terms of improvements, we're seeing that the the automatic windshield wipers. They have not activated as yet because before, right. even though it's dry and sunny like this, perhaps because of sun and glare or whatever, it would it would turn on and that, that could mess up your windshield wipers and your windshield and so on, give it uh, micro scratches, etc. But I'm not seeing that now, so that that's good. Hopefully, that sticks <laughs> with this. Uh, it sticks with this software and forward goes forward. Yeah, we have clear skies right now. Even um, the last update. Um, it was really rainy like a few days ago or something and it was just like not up to par with what was needed like it it was it wasn't really doing what i needed it to do like it was like pouring and it was just doing le like level two not level three yes they were there were some concerns about that too as well like your whole screen will just be covered in in rain you could barely see what's there but then the windshield wipers will just go boop, boop, and then that's it it, when it, it should be continuously going at speed. Oh, what's happening? It's a fire truck. Let's see. Does it recognize fire trucks as yet? Nope. It's just a big old semi truck. Oh, hey! It's a bus? Oh, it's a bus. Okay. It's a truck. <laughs> what is it? Squishy. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, I was in the wrong way. So, a lot of traffic on the roads, actually. And uh, we have right of way now. I would start picking up some pace. Yeah, we She's should. She's doing it a little bit, but is she going to hesitate on the left turn here? She is hesitating and I'm giving it some jewels because we have cars yeah. behind us. Come on. We should actually, for that kind of turn, the only time it's acceptable to be up someone's bum is like that kind of turn. 
when you have a right of way, you have a protected left turn, and you need to you need to go. <laughs> yeah, because everyone needs to, to everyone wants to pass because then you're gonna cause uh, additional traffic. Certain certain um, places like that, it's not just a, a twofer. It's like they leave it on for a while, so you have to get as many people through as possible. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I honestly, I, I wasn't. I'm not surprised, but I'm I'm also, I'm I'm kind of disappointed because I was hoping you know at least yeah. have some slight change in terms of the assertion going on that left turn still hesitated at the wrong time like like when in i was in the middle, in of, the the middle of the road exactly so that's not good but i will say though i feel like the last time we did that same exact turn it was very slightly better this time well, I had to give it some juice. Eh? Okay, okay. So I had to... Interview. Is that in the intersection or before? That, that? was in the intersection. It's, as soon as I realized that it was slowing down and there, yeah. there was a car right behind me. Look at this guy coming with some pace here. So, kind of close. Kind of close to us too as well. I was a little bit hesitant. Yeah. Okay. She did good. But they're, they're riding in between two lanes now. Yeah, I don't know what this guy is doing to be honest. I honestly don't want to know. <laughs> well, she wants to change lanes here, but I think that lane is uh, closing. Oh, not this one. It's um, I don't know why the sign is here. Actually, it doesn't. It's not even closed. Just want to slow it down a little bit here. We have There's some a little bit of a sign poking yeah, out some there. Random stuff on the. But road. actually, this is good because I think the left her the left lane. Um, that was actually have. a good move from Asha. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know how she knew that, but she was new. Unless she was just trying to do the right thing, which is stay. She's gonna right. let this car pass now, though. This car hasn't indicated as yet, so I mean, am I supposed to assume you want a spot or? I feel like she's giving them a spot. Oh, now I feel like she is. Well, now they indicate. Now they're getting she's into getting the lane. Getting too close, though. She's getting a little, yeah, a little too close, but she actually stopped and gave them some space. I would still report that personally, just because I didn't like. Because if you're coming in right and you see the person inching up, you would be like, "Do I have a space?" Yeah. I would be confused. Okay. Yeah, so that was reported. We now want to get into this left lane here, but I uh, guess Marsha wants to just stick to the right lane, let any car overtake. Yeah, which is fine, but it's going to bump it down to 50 because we need to start getting into the left lane soon. Yeah. Sooner okay. rather than later. And we have um, you know, some cars making some left turns here. Yeah, it's not bad. Um, this person's a little bit confusing because they're on our lane and they had a, a right indicator. Yeah, Marsha okay. seems to be confused too as well, but that's perfect. Um, Indicates to get into the lane. I think we it. might have a busy time over there. <laughs> yeah, this is the Downsview Market. Oh, okay. Okay, indicates in advance, then goes into the lane. Right, that's how it should be done. You indicate, you let this, the cars behind know that you're going somewhere other than going straight. Yeah. And then you get into the lane when it's safe to do so, and, and that's what Marshall did, and that was good. You need to consistently do that, whether, whether it's going on ramp or off ramp. Every time. But why whoa, are we going whoa, so whoa, close? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Why is she getting so close to this person and then okay, stopping so quickly? Okay, that's not so what we meant earlier. <laughs> yeah. We meant something a little bit. Uh, yeah, that was uh, kind of bad. But There's uh, a car in front you know. of them, I think. Looks like Yeah, it, they do. So it's good that she's staying here. She could, she could be, go up a little bit more though. You have some room. Just to the line, I think, is appropriate. Because uh, even she can jewels. see it here. Okay. Um, why are they turning? Wow. What? What a douche. That move. is really dangerous. <laughs> That's like, do they want an accident? I don't understand. Well, they saw it here first, guys. <laughs> oh, we have a bunch of traffic Caught coming on in. Tape. We're going to be going in. We have room now. If she wants, she could swing in. Yeah, we gotta go before that bike. Yeah, she got to go quickly, comes. and she does that Woo! with at full acceleration. I mean, that was. Yeah, I'm starting to get a headache now. <laughs> yeah, that was that was a little bit. That, uh, a, a little, little bit too sketch. much. Yeah, like it could have been that could have been achieved at a more gradual, like yeah, not really gradual, but more consistent just, speed across well, the board. Well, the thing is, she needs to realize and act on it quickly, right? Because I'm, I don't know, you know, like it making decisions okay this and any other like it took too long to make that left turn i would have made that left turn as soon as i saw the gap right probably, yeah probably with three or four measure, seconds before yeah. three or four seconds before marsha made that left turn and so. you don't have to kind of do like an exponential speed speed up like that you can just kind of like do the same speed across like yeah. a 30 across the board and that would have achieved the same thing 
Okay, this feels like it is going to go straight up to the... Like 60, like 0 to 60 yeah. kind of yeah, feeling. I'm going to all stop here. You can go. Okay. You We're can go. What is what's a, going on? On a thing there. Okay. Okay. So I was a little bit hesitant there. A little bit early um, indicator there. Right turn. Would be nice park in front of us. All the fall colors. Yeah, it's very nice. Wow. Yeah, there is looking nice too. <laughs> this is not a real bridge. This is just for people. So yeah, we're coming around the bend. Take a little turn here. Yeah, she can do. Kind of taking it really wide. Yeah, I think she's confused. Okay. Oh, okay. What's going on here? It's the first time this is being done. That's different. Uh, does she want to go left? Is or? she confused? Definitely can't go in there. <laughs> okay, and on that bump show, <laughs> <laughs> that's going to be it. Before it used to take us uh, right in the parking lot there. So it seems that you know there's some inconsistency, like overall. Overall, I mean, I'll start with my, from my point of view, the parking spots. So, you know, actually smart someone and uh, the parking lots that um, Tesla is promising in terms of having it navigate through parking lots. That thing, that is not ready as yet at all. I mean, you can see from the beginning of our video how it, <laughs> how it traversed uh, a busy Costco parking lot. Um, yeah. If it's empty, sure, it might, it might do it, but then it's going to be all over the place. Um, so there's still some improvements to be made there. The navigation we spoke about, the windshield wipers, automatic windshield wipers, um, that seems to be fixed hopefully right now. And um, still hesitations on the on the left turns. So not really much improvements I feel from this uh, first impression uh, right now, to be honest. What are your thoughts? Yeah, I'm not sure. Yeah, like normally we go into the correct place. So this time actually, did it take into account the environment before the the map data? That's what I feel like it just did because we had that issue before the last update mm. where it was taking the map data into account like more than the environment. You're talking about the last part here, right? Um, no, yeah, like what just happened it just when you came here in too as well because I'm I'm not too sure why it went we've always went into the right there this is the yeah. first time it Look, didn't do that it literally says it right here it goes right here but then but then the it, lane... it started going too wide and yeah. then it kind of like like why is it even there though? and then went that way like is it supposed to be on the right side we normally yeah. we normally we're supposed to make a right here Oops. yeah so <laughs> yeah so that's strange folks what, what, what are your thoughts like let us know on in that regard so that means we have to do a, a highway 7 test again to see if it's going to go in the right um the 400 to, to highway 7 we're gonna have to check that again because that's what we had the last update is that it didn't go in the right lane to mm. to go straight it was uh, going in the right turn lane so maybe maybe that's improved maybe that's a map data improvement change Oof, I'm not rather sure. than improvement we're gonna to have to do some more testing folks to let you know and 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 we'll see what's what's going on here because this is some new behavior we're, we're experiencing right now <laughs> um we also have to push it too as well in some heavy heavy traffic so we'll see how that goes you can check us out check out our, our previous videos um we had we had one uh recently that was our first impressions on the highway for dot two and um uh, we have some other ones coming out, so check out those ones, and and uh, we'll see you in the next video, hopefully soon. Thank you for tuning in. Don't forget to like, subscribe, click that notification bell, and have yourself a lovely day. Bye. Bye.